six. When Solomon started talking about all the stuff he had. Okay. Let's see what Solomon said. Ecclesiastes chapter 1 verse 12. I, the preacher, was king over Israel and Jerusalem. Yeah, it's talking about King Solomon, which if you're spiritual and you have understanding, that's your house shot. That's who you really call Jesus Christ in his past life. He was king over Israel. Keep reading. And I gave my heart to seek and to search out my wisdom concerning all things that are done under the heaven. Uh-huh. This sort of uh, travel have God given to his sons of men to be ex ex exercised their will. Uh -huh. I have been all, I have seen all the works that are done under the sun. Uh -huh. And behold, all is vanity and vexation, vexation, Vex vexation. vexation of spirit. Of spirit. So King Solomon, which if you read the history about King Solomon, he was the, one of the wisest kings, the wisest king of all time, the richest king of all time. Because these, these so-called uh, Jay-Z's, Nas, who, who else is one of these big-time, simple-ass niggas that these, these niggas worship, man, and follow? Kanye West, uh, Beyonce, they ain't shit. Oprah, they, they got pennies compared to Solomon, man. He had gold, not no Federal Reserve note, not no debt, debt note that's worthless. Simple ass niggas, man. That that which is crooked cannot be made straight. Yeah, and that's that that goes with Esau, that goes with these heathens, and that goes with two-thirds of our people, man. They're not gonna get right on this side, man. They're gonna have to uh suffer the death of the uncircumcision, man. They're gonna have to be destroyed with America. Okay? Because they love America. Here it is, America is systematically set up to destroy you, Negro, Latino, and Native American, man. All right, before you even exit the womb, and if you do exit the womb, everything systematically set up to either kill you or, or transform you into a damn woman or a feminine, soft, weak, I feel you on that one. weak man. I feel you on that one. That's right. Okay, and then you, then you, uh, you people, you get an attitude. Anytime we speak rough, like that simple ass nigga that came up here uh, when we was talking about him going to hunt down females. That's his whole objective. <laughs> Spending five hours in the mirror to go hunt down females. He said, you out of line, brother. Am I? That's what they program our people to be. If you ain't an athlete, a singer, a dancer, uh, a damn, uh, help me out. A uh, singer, an actor, a model, then you one of these uh, thug, gremlin ass niggas, man. And that's all they want you to be. On a destructive path, man. All right? That's what they want. And if you can't see that, then you, you're destined to get destroyed, man. There's no help. There's no hope for you, man. All right, because Solomon saw all these things and he said it was vexation of spirit, man. All right? Keep reading. That which is crooked cannot be made straight, and that which is and that which is wanting cannot be numbered. Yeah, that which is wanting. All right? Hold that. Give, give Romans 11 and 7. Because what Israel, what, if I, what is our people searching for? They want the truth, man. But it's only a small number that's gonna get it. And like that, like that actor Jack Nichols, Nicholson said in that movie, A Few Good Men, he said when, when uh, Tom Cruise was uh, grilling him on the on the uh, the uh, the uh, damn, help me out. When they be interrogating him on the stand, he said he said I want the truth. He said truth, truth. You can't handle the truth, and two thirds of our people can't handle the, the truth. Or the reality of the situation that America was not set up for us to be prosperous, man. And that the society is set to destroy us. Seven. Romans chapter 11, verse 7. What then? Israel have not attained that which is seeking for. Yeah. But the election have attained it, and the rest were blind. The rest were blind. That's right. Two thirds, they searching for the truth, so they think the truth is in, in uh, uh, Masonry. Being a mason, 
or the truth is in being uh, a five percenter or Egyptologist, an Asiatic black man. Oh, the, oh, the truth is in, in hip hop and in, in the entertainment world. Not knowing that all those avenues, it leads to death and destruction, man. Or the truth is in these churches. Where every week, every week it seems like it's a new scandal with the church, man. These pastors either stealing from their congregation or they molesting children. The Lord never molests children, all right? He wasn't sodomizing little boys and girls, man. But these Catholic church, all right, they do that constantly, man. That's why that Pope had to step down, man. Because the light was being shined on him, man. But you know what? Our people will still go to the Catholic church tomorrow. And they'll still go to their uh, Baptist or whatever church they go to, man. Because they love lies, man. Keep reading. Uh, Romans? Yeah. Romans chapter 11, verse 8. According, according as it is written, the Most High giveth them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear, unto this day. Unto this day. That's why, even though it's, it's plenty of jakes out here, it was like that last year when we was out here. It was sunny last year. Yeah, it was sunny, it was hot, you know. Oh, it was, it was slightly warm. Was it sunny? Was it March? Yeah, it was in March. You can tell, so you can tell by the weather. It snowed today. Yeah. And last year it was hot. You know? You know, the signs are March normally be this coming to springtime, right? Yeah. Yeah, so it should be it should be hot. But it snowed. That's right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Please ask these chapter one verse sixteen. <laughs> With my own heart, saying, Lo, I have come to a great estate, and have gotten more wisdom than all they that have been before me uh -huh. in Jerusalem. I gave my heart a great experience of wisdom and knowledge. I gave my heart to know wisdom and to know madness and folly. Yeah, to know madness and folly. All right? Because it's a balance, man. Even though we don't desire to know what these simple-minded Negroes be into, that's in the world, what they love getting into, but we gotta know what they into so that we can correct them properly and judge them accordingly, man. All right? Shit, man. I didn't think it was gonna rain. Read that again. Ecclesiastes chapter 1 verse Ecclesiastes 1 and Vexation of the spirit. It's vexation of the spirit. Okay, one is it's 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 very hard to stay focused in this society, regardless if you if you just trying to focus on the truth, period. Alright? How much more for these simple-minded, these two-third jakes out here that's all into folly and madness, man? Okay. How much more? What you want? I don't want to mess up. That's how I messed up last song. Yeah. All right, but we got to know what Jake be into, man. All right, to an extent. We don't dive all into it. That's how niggas bug out. That's how that one dude, was named Symphony uh, 69 or whatever, or that faggy ass nigga, he... He wanted to get all into learning about the uh, the, uh, the music industry and what these niggas be into, besides just getting what he needed from that, to just bring that info out, 
He wanted to go extra deep. Now he bugged out, man. He on some other shit, man. Okay? 